Hey guys, and welcome back. Let's play some old Good Stalker Evolution. This is mod version 1.011 of 15 February 2022. Engine is the old Good Stalker Remash Reloaded. I don't know, engine 46. Uh, 64 bits 2021 So we're gonna start a new game on veteran So, for those who don't know, this is a custom slash modded version of the first Stalker game called of Chernobyl, no, Shadow of Chernobyl with different quests, different graphics, drivable vehicles, a lot of stuff that's been added. And it's just a reason to come back and replaying the first game of Stalker. So let's start. We're going to skip the intro and start from there. Here we go. So, Mark One, I saved you. And I'm not going to pretend I did it to win favors upstairs. You do some jobs for me, and we're even. Besides, keeping you busy might be a good way to deal with your amnesia. And I'll see what I can find out about you. I don't give a shit why you want to find this fella guy. I mind my own business. If you want to kill him, well, you must have your own. Okay. The choice is yours. Either I play Marshall like I usually do with all the rookies, or I treat you like a real star. I give you a mission straight away. Uh, just give me a mission. First task is to get the Bloodstone artifact. And here is a ravine, various anomalies. The artifact is somewhere in the center of it. Understood. Bring the radioactive Bloodstone artifact. I'll be on my way. Now. As I said, it's a modded version of the first Stalker game. But it looks really different. It has a different vibe, different engine. Uh, it's hard to pinpoint, but it's it's different. It really is. Alright, so this Soroga Stalin. Hello. Good morning, sir. What's your name and rank? I don't remember. So you're a greenhorn. I'm a veteran so far, I've spent a year in this shithole. I know everyone and everyone knows me. You'll pay me 300 rubles for each visit to Sodorovich, otherwise I won't let you into the bunker. This is a shakedown. Of course, I was going to throw some bolts at him, but that doesn't do anything. Anyway, <clears throat> you can't go into Rookie Village yet. So you gotta do the first quest is to find Don't that artifact. Don't Open the door. I need to see him. You got 300. I don't have it. Okay. Now, I need to change the running key. Let me see. Sprinting is X. I prefer the shift key. So now I can actually run using shift. And W A S D keys. So, yeah, it looks kind of so so, hmm? especially the character models. But I have to say, some of the environments look really nice. So, 
We're going to go over to the ravine that is somewhere. Not sure where it is. All right, here we go. Find the artifact. I don't have a PDA yet, so it's really something you should know is that this is the ravine need to find the artifact. There's this uh, helicopter, attack helicopter right there. We're gonna do a uh, an attack on some guys, and we'll have to work, uh, help them out. So, here's the uh, the place where we need to find the artifact. The graphics are really nice. Look at the fog. Really, really nice. Now, especially the, uh, the environments look really good, but uh, the let's just say the uh, the character models not really. So, oh, the hell with that. The artifact, bring it later. Go to the trailer by the road. My boys need help. Though. Guess what? We those Marns shot the helicopter, and now I'm receiving an SOS call. Alright, now... Since we are here... I don't know, to find the artifact is... a challenge, so... Um, but I do have this... this thing... Oh, this is just a radio. It's kind of funny that he sends me on this mission to find an artifact, and I just have... I only have bolts to... to use. Uh, but, it, oh, you know, it's fine. We'll just abandon the quest right now, because uh, we need to help some stalkers who are in trouble. Now, I'm gonna go by the, to the trailer. Um, I'm not sure where that is. It's by the road, so we gotta go back. You know, in my eyes, this doesn't really look that bad, does it? Uh oh. Oh, look at that! There's just an artifact lying around. Just like that. The activation of an artifact can only be performed under certain circumstances. It is required to manipulate the artifact in a specific manner so that to reach necessary activation conditions, some artifacts are act activated by warmth of the body in quite simple movements. Okay, what kind of artifact is this? Let me check. I'm not sure. Um, what is it? Uh, how do we get information on this thing? Oh, look at this. You can actually put it in your hands. Oh, look at this. A radiation plus five. Bullet. Bullet plus five? Weak protective shield whose side effect is slight radiation. Okay. I'll just hold on to it. You know, it's just lying around, the artifact. It's kind of weird. But as I said, I just don't have, um... Oh, okay. Oh, God. Um, the thing about this modded version of the first game is that... It's super hard. Well, at least... It, um... It's like... Enemies are really bullet spongy-ish. And if you get hit by one of these mutants, then... You're dead, basically, so it's one hit, one kill type of situation. So, yeah, not great. But, you know, somebody in the comment section actually challenged me to play this game. And I already played it before, but not the newest version of it. 
Gotta find the trailer by the road, it said. Okay, right here. Oh, look at this. Search the body. Uh-oh. Gotta keep an eye on... Oh. Let's see how interesting the AI is here. They don't seem... They don't have... They have, no, they, they have not noticed me before. Just yet. All right, we're gonna take the stuff. Help me, brother. Take the med kit off the this guy also had an artifact on him. Um, I'm, I'm used to playing anomaly, uh, so I'm not 100% sure how to do this. Help me, brother. Take the med kit off the stiff. I can't reach it. Okay. Um. Oh, now I have nothing anymore? Alright, we gotta find a health kit. Here we go. And then give it to the guy. He's gonna be great. Me, brother! Take the med kit off the stiff! Alright, take it. That far. Here you go. So I've healed the guy. Find this. Oh, he's gonna shoot. Oh, look at that. Okay. Let's get used to this. Like picking up stuff is kind of different than an anomaly. Uh, um. So I have this suit, this artifact, but I don't know how to use it. Or is it just? Like if I put it here. Oh, look at that. Radiation plus five, bullets plus five. No, better put it in my backpack. I don't want to die because of radiation. Okay. Thank you, Marked One. You're okay, you know that? I'll be sure to tell everyone at the camp that you helped me out. Okay. You do that. Meanwhile, I will be looting these corpses <sighs> there are actually three oh he's got a weapon so now I found a weapon and my friend is going to the uh, the village so that he can tell me about and tell the other folks that I'm good a good guy all right here we go. We also have a pistol now. So we got a, a, a weapon and a pistol. So we got this weapon. We got this one. Sort of a shotgun. That we can reload like this. That's nice. Alright, so we got two weapons. Let me see. I also, also have a pistol. I can use... Alright. Mark 1, you shouldn't be be far to look. Thanks for helping Tolik. You can come to the village whenever you want. Okay. Alright, so that's a good thing. Let's just look around here. It's so interesting that it, it looks so different from Stalker Anomaly. But great, you know, it looks great. But so different. I don't know, it's a different kind of engine. Switch the body. All right. Pick that one up. Let's check this body. Look at this. Um... Okay. Another dog here. We've got another tail or whatever they are. Dog tail. Yeah, right. All right. So so far so good. Oh man, it's been a while since I've played this. And again, I'm just super surprised how it looks. Really nice. 
crisp and clear. I mean, it's just, it's just crazy to realize how this game has sort of evolved. Really, really interesting. I don't have any, uh, no, I don't have um, binoculars. I think, no. So that's something to think about. And look at the smoke. There's different kinds of anomalies and uh, sun rays. Really, really nice. And considering this is a game from, I don't know, early 2000s. All these different effects. Super. I mean, look at this. This is amazing. Interesting. Anyway, let's not get too distracted and head back to the village. Since we now can actually enter the village. There's a checkpoint up ahead. We shouldn't go there yet. Let's go back to the village. Really cool. I'm happy that this, this person that commented on me, on oh, my channel, said that I should really play this. Ah, oh, man. Uh, where's the village, by the way? That's up north. I think we need to go this way. Oh, I, I know Corden. The back of my hand, so to speak. I know where to go. Alright, let's go into the village. Oh, wow. Look at this guy. <laughs> Not the best looking models, but still. Super interesting. Hey, who's this guy? No привет. Hi. Who are you? I'm a local celebrity. I play guitar and sing songs about the zone. Alright, so this guy needs vodka. It's good to know. Now, there's always something I want to check. One of these houses might have an interesting item. Oh, there's a box. Oh, there's actually something there. Some more ammo, and this is a adrenaline rush. Energy drink. Cool. But there is a house here that might have some gear. No, it just looks really different from Anomaly. Very different. Very, very different. I need to sort of find my bearings. There might be a little stash here. Usually there is a stash here. No, nothing. There is something here. Uh, let's have a look. Nothing. Okay. Maybe we should talk to Wolf or Fanatic. What's his name? I don't know if he's here. Oh, this guy. Um, how's Tolik? All right. He gives me bandage and an army medikit. Thank you. Anything else? Okay, nothing. Okay. We're just exploring. Just looking around. Oh! This is obviously a traitor. The weapons, understood. Uh, this is, um, yeah. It provides a whole range of services. Quick. 
qualitative repairs. Special orders. Right. Interesting. You placed an order with this guy. There's another seller right here. In Anomaly, you can actually pick some stuff up here. And you can do that too, here. Interesting. We're just looking around. Let's go back to Sudorovich. Probably have something for me. Let's go back into the cellar. Right, here we go. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Bribe the guard. Okay. Here we are. Open the door. 300 rubles. Okay. So I lost 300 rubles. Had to pay the guy off. The Stalin guy. So, yeah. With that name... What do you expect? All right. Hello. To get dragged out of the death truck. Yes, that's me. I'm a mercenary. I've been in the zone nearly three years. Okay. Um, okay. I just don't understand what these trucks were. Are they going? And most importantly, why? Well, the passengers, and what does that tattoo mean? What happened next? The course was not an emission, but something else. Well, the stalker tried for some time to find and revive his old friend, but he was gone. I think the zone has had removed his companion, because a month later his friend appeared in the bar, dejected, wearing a burned suit and carrying a different weapon. Hmm, something to think about. Good luck to you too. Okay. So now we have access to Sodorovich again. So Let's go well. talk to him. Have you brought the artifacts? Not yet. Although, I have an artifact, so we can trade. Can we trade the artifact that I have? What are you going to give me for that? 1,353. Not bad. Okay. What about this? Small backpack. I don't have a backpack, so... I might want to buy one. Oh, that's a lot of money. I have 4,375. This costs 2,470. But I'll take Not it anyway. Bad. Some pretty good stuff you've got there. I'll take it That's because uh, it allows me to um, carry more stuff, I reckon. Let's see, how do I equip that? Use? Okay. So now I can carry 70 kilos. That's nice. What about... Um, A like one of those apparatus that you can use to track down the artifacts. Oh, I actually want to buy this one as well. Not bad. Some pretty good stuff you've got. I have a, a, a binoculars. Let me see what else. That's a nice suit, though. I don't think I can afford it, but I only have a radio. How do I find the artifacts? How, how how does that work? All right, but I have this thing. That's nice. All right. I might have to do some. Quest for other guys. Okay. 
If I'm not mistaken, I can now access this, uh, the Rookie Village. What about this guy? Again. On my way, okay. So, seems like I need to, um... Still find the artifact. What's this? Oh, dosimeter. When the radiation is detected, the device beeps. Must be placed in a special equipment cell for proper operation. How do I... Uh, is that the thing that I need to use when looking for artifacts or something? I don't think so. Now... There could be something here, and I know for a fact that there might be a different type of suit stashed somewhere, but I'm not sure if this is also in the mod. Let's go and jump here. Oh, oh well, this definitely looks different. Now this is crate, right? I can pick this up. What did I just pick up? What is that? A huge piece of salted fat, an object of worship for stalkers from Ukraine. Local traders greet, makes them use flashes fat for cooking. That's why it's slightly contaminated with radiation, but it's just the thing to satisfy one's hunger, especially when taken with vodka. Okay, so you can use that to still your hunger. Okay, makes sense. But again, I want to find that artifact for Sodorovich. How do I find it without that uh, special thing, that meter that you need to... Uh, find the artifact. This is interesting. Um, do you have any questions? Nope. Mm. Oh, look at this. Search the cache. It's a backpack. Brad, Ducktail, Dreamland. Yes, my inventory. The backpack has nothing. It's interesting to know that you can actually drop stuff here in the backpack. You got the. Uh, can you repair re equipment? One in the basements. Okay. All right. See you. Um, how do you expect me to find that artifact when I'm? I don't have anything to track it down with. This is strange. Anyway. Go on, get out of my sight. Still might be able to find it, but I have to rely on my memory. And if memory serves me right, uh, we should still be able to find that artifact. Somewhere hidden in this pit. Alright. I just don't remember exactly where it is. But it is somewhere. Now what about that dozy meter? Or so, what's it... What's it called? I don't know. Check this. Binoculars bolt detector. Detector, okay. Uh, what kind of key are we going to assign it for? Uh, detector. Like the alt key. Does that work? Okay. Do I have the detector at all? No, I don't have it. So how do... How do they expect me to find any... Artifact here with no detector? That makes no sense. Alright. Let's try it anyway. 
anyway. It should be somewhere around the tree. Oh, look at this. We found it. Find. We found the artifact. Oh god, how do we get out of this pit? Not very healthy. It doesn't look healthy. Alright. Let's run back to Sudorovich. Given the artifacts we found. Well, let's check out the artifacts first. Let me, let me see. It's this one. Impacts, rapture, bullets, bleeding, radiation plus hundred. Wow. Here it is. Take it. Got a job. All right, got a new job. I want you to find a stalker of me. some very important information. He's disappeared some very important somewhere near the bridge. Find him. He He's alive. I don't care. I need right. a flash drive. Okay. We got a sleeping bag. Bayonet. Get information from the scouts. Okay. Got a knife as well. Interesting. So we got a sleeping bag that we can use. I guess we can use this in the field somewhere when we need to sleep. And uh, here's... Uh, this is a bandage pack. How do you use quick slots in this game? I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Um, okay, now we'll have to find a scout. All right. Oh, I guess that's wolf or... Wolf, all right. That makes sense. All right, this guy. Here we go. Uh, I need to see Nimble. Would you know where to find him? Nimble got a raw deal. His group attacked by some bandits. A little ways from here. All he could do was send an SOS. Uh, nope, you don't stand a chance. My scouts are there. Okay, I'll try. All right. Guys, I'm sending someone your way, so wing it. You may attack if necessary. Over. All right, Wolf, send him in. As long as he stays out of the way. Out. Okay. Ничего, ничего. Нормалёк. Прорвёмся. Не зря же я тут вон. All right. Well. we'll just meet up with the uh, scouts. Now we already have some weapons, so that's pretty fun. So it does follow the basic storyline of the first Stalker game, but it sort of deviates from that, adding different characters, different sides, stories. That's pretty fun. So, scouts are there. Let's talk to the scouts. Bite down, man. Let me fill you in. Okay. Э, нет, убери ствол, тогда ты заманал, понял? What are you doing? Dude. Oh, I was pointing a gun at him. Sorry about that. Good lord. Um. Right, how many bandits? Uh, seven or eight. Two by the gate, two more in the building. To the right near the fire, and another two in the one to the left. That's where they're keeping nimble. OK. 
Okay. Uh, can we solve this a different way? Well, we thought at first we tricked them, then we changed our minds. What do you mean? The idea is to disguise one of them. Oh, a message from the boss. Why not? I'll try it. Uh, if this idea fails, they will tear you to pieces and feed you to mutants. Uh, it's risky one or another, so what's your next move? First, we have to dress you up like one of them, and then we forge a transfer order to give to the guy calling the shots there. This should convince them to release the prisoner into your custody, and then both of you leave. That's uh, how simple it is. Uh, we have to. We have one of their coats. But the notes, that's the tricky part. Well, none of my friends spend any time in prison, so we don't have any experience to forge it. Really? There's no time to look for someone. I have to compromise. Of compose it. Okay. So here I have a piece of paper, slightly torn. It's better than nothing. Where's my pencil? So in short, these thugs need to believe that this transfer order is from someone in authority. Here we go. Hello, you wankers. Hey, you. Yes, you. That's a little bit over the top. Yeah, definitely. Another bandit. They always try to seem tough, so... Then we write, release the captive to this guy without delay, or I will personally tear your eyes and throat. Hmm. Might work. Okay, thank you. Um, right. Now that's interesting, because now we have an alternative way of dealing with the situation, other than just moving in and, uh, yeah, just basically shooting them all. So now I've disguised myself, it seems, as, uh, as a bandit, so... I might be able to pull this off, or not. I don't know, we'll see. We're just gonna walk right into their nest, so to speak. Hopefully we can come to an agreement, give them the note, and then get the prisoner without any bloodshed. That'll be interesting. So, it's really cool that this mod sort of gives you that alternative route. Either go in guns blazing or just... Talk to them. Why, hello. Um, Alright, see you. Well, so far it works, actually. They don't see me as a threat, per se. Hello? Uh, hello? Alright, get the same dialogue. Who are we going to talk to in order to progress this quest? I don't know. But this guy? Um, hello? Can you tell me about this place? Just wrote to the zone. Okay. Uh, what do we have here? Uh, hi, brother. I have a message from Borov. From whom? Don't you know Borov? He's the big boss. Oh, I know he's the big boss. But why the hell would he send us a message all of a sudden? Um, it's fairly busy, so he sent me. Give it to me. There you go. Who the hell is this from? I don't understand. What's the problem? Don't you dare me... Don't you dare tell me that Borov wrote it. What the hell is this crap? Wankers? I'll poke your eyes out. I'll get nasty. What the hell is... With all the mistakes. Borov is well educated. Proud of it. And his men respect him for it. Listen. This belongs... In the trash, doesn't no, it? No, I didn't. Um, 
Why are you making such a big deal out of this? I, if you're trying to act like well, a big shot barf will shoot you, or, or I'll just oh, come clean. I'll say, I'll tell you like it, it, it is. Man, if you Make like it quick. This, you'll be you Who are you? I'm actually stalking on the bandits. Don't be in a hurry to shoot. I come in priest. Why spill blood? No, that's probably not the greatest well, approach. Um. Frere wrote the transfer order for the prisoner and asked me to deliver it on his behalf. Why is that? Recently he scored a big time, so he decided to lay low for a while because he doesn't want to attract attention. Probably lost his cards again, playing with his brothers, haha. <laughs> now he won't be japping about his good luck. Okay. Forget what I said, just give me the note and take your fucking loser and get that out of. Alright, I got it. I'm gonna roast you over See you. Oh, that actually worked. I swear, it's no joking matter. Hello? You guys still alive? What the heck is going on? Uh, let's find the captive somewhere. Where the hell is he? Man, what a day. Damn, is somebody going to save me or what? Oh, he's downstairs. Right Help me. Okay. I owe you, brother. I could never thank you enough. I owe you, brother. I could never thank you enough. All right, all right. Um, I need the flash drive you were talking... You were taking to the trader. Do you have it? Here we go. Thanks. Uh, where did you keep it anyway? Who knows? Might come in handy. I didn't keep it... Down there, so don't worry. <laughs> like in his ass or something. I've worked for the trader for a long time, so I can store information safely. By the way, I told the thugs a nice little story about a cache full of artifacts, and they ordered one guy to go there. The cache exists, but it's only got one artifact. I can give you the coordinates if you want. Sure. Don't forget, there's a lot of wild animals there, besides the gangster they send is armed with more than a scope and a shovel so be careful okay um cool I so owe you, brother i could never thank you enough so hello so the um the guy is <laughs> is pushing away the bandits so he's free to go um that means that I actually can kill the bandits in the car park, or get the flash drive, take the flash drive to the trader, which means that we go back to Sodorovich, uh, turn in the uh, the quest, and um, I think it's that way, but I'm not sure. Let me see. Oh, I'm going the wrong way, so we need to go that way. I want to come back to Storvich. So yeah, it's uh, it's actually really funny. Without having to shoot a single shot, I freed the the captive or the hostage. And uh, he's gonna just leisurely <laughs> walk to the uh, the camp. Now we could um, start shooting them. It is tempting. It is tempting, but I I guess I need to do it alone then. You know, I'm starting to look for locations to uh, to loot, but uh, some of the stuff is just an anomaly not in old good stalker so um, just to give you an illustration of how like how bullet spongy this game can be it's one one shot one kill basically so there we go I think I killed one, but even if you shoot them in the in the face,
they won't go down that easily. So, let me save the game so that uh, I can at least restart the game from this point. I think I shot one in. Whoa! Oh, here we go. When they hit you, you're dead, basically. Not completely, I guess. Alright. Kill one. There's another one. Okay. Another guy there. Oh. They will advance on you. Oh god. Um. Oh, no more ammo. Running! Let's get away. Let's get away. Wasted all my bullets. So you can... You can... Whoa! Okay. You can tell how s bullet spongy these, these enemies are. Good lord. Again, I need to use... A health pack. Are they following? No, they aren't. Alright, I can ask them to, to join me, maybe. Uh, let's go. Men, Wolf here sent us some support along with the order to attack. Okay. Time to move on and be heroes. You go, you go in. I already shot a few, so it's up to you guys to sort of mop everything up. Here we go. And I'll, I'll just be Don't there to, uh... to loot the corpses. Here's the guy. Oh great. It's got some... Oh, I don't have... Uh, not, not the bullets that I need. Oh, he has, he has actually got an AK. Nice. They're all dead. What's this? 
I don't know. Whoa! There are also bodies here. Where did it all come from? Nothing. Money received, okay. Oh! I got one. Oh! So that was fun. Not sure about the hat bopping. By the way, look at this. That's crazy. How do I remedy that? Uh, bandage? Or medical kits, physical damage and blood loss? What about this blue one? Let's use the blue one. See if that works. Alright. That's better. So, we now go back. Oop, look at that. Ah! Oh god. More head bobbing. Where's that beast? Oh god, I get sick of this head bobbing. How do you get rid of that? I don't know. Jeez, this is. This is some serious shit. Um, oh, I guess I'm carrying too much. Maybe that's the problem. But I'll sell all these weapons to Storvich, I guess. And then, sort of, yeah. Finish this. It's a lovely day, by the way. All of a sudden. Sun's coming out. I don't know, I just like the atmosphere of this game. It's just really good. Let's see what's next. It really has its own style. Домой хочу. Домой. Okay. Let's go down. Turn the quest in. Get the reward. Mark. Uh, situation's clear. Flash drive. Here it is. So get some money for that. Medikit. Field repair kit. Any special missions for me? We've planned a small deal with the military. Give them 10 artifacts, and in return, um, we get a bunch of new weapons. Alright, deal with the military. Um, other missions? No. Oh, that's cool. I need a job. Hunting trophies. Uh, destroy the bandit camp. I'm up for it. So, yeah. Also, hopefully I can sell some weapons to him. Oh no, that's his stuff. I'm sorry. Uh, this one. This one. Oh, he doesn't take these. Oh, he does. Well, I don't need so many weapons, but this is, this, these are only the weapons that I I got from just doing, just clearing the uh, the vehicle uh, place. 
Этот взгляд словно лучший суд для ребят. Not bad. Here we go. Pretty good stuff you've got there. One, uh, ten thousand four hundred forty-five. That's cool. Really nice. So yeah. Anyway, guys, it's my boy. thanks for watching. I think it has to do with the fact that I was over encumbered. If you were too carrying too much stuff, your hat will bob. Now it's okay. So I'm fine. Anyway, again, thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.